You are now at the round table with Lenny S. Maya the Brazilian Air and Big Life. Okay, everybody, on with the show. Take a seat and tune in. What's up, y'all? It's Amanda Diva, the original Zufa. Lenny S. Mida B. and Big Light right here on Rock Me TV. Don't drink that screen. Yeah, link shots once again. <laughs> Round table in the building. Official tissue. Live and direct. RockMeTV.com. Big up to Rashida. Yes. She was definitely in the house. Shoes. Bourgeois C shoes. That's what bougie up here. That's what That's we do today. Right. But now we got Amanda. Amanda Diva in the building. Amanda Diva has too many titles, so we gotta wait till she gets out here and run them all down. Amanda, yes. what's up? Look at Amanda. Yeah, she came out here fast too. On this is what she does, so <laughs> she's very comfortable with this. I mean, you know, we've been trying to get you for months now. Yeah, I heard you throwing barbs months, while I was months. backstage. It was harder to get you than like, Roxy. Choo, choo, choo. Oh my god! Hunting. No, because the first time I didn't know that it was on television. Uh, I didn't know it was on screen, so I wasn't dressed. I was like running around all day. You're not the only. I don't blame you for that because also Kim Osario hit me this morning and she was like, "I'm not camera ready," and I was like, "I feel you because I don't like going on camera unless I'm right, official. unless you know." And but then you're the official. Second time, I couldn't find it. You couldn't find it. There's nothing the outside point. that oh, right. lets there you is, know. That, that is true. I actually end up going to the door next door. Right. Amanda, whatever. You're here. It's great. Thank Happy you for to be coming. Here. Let's We're talk so about excited. you. Let's talk about what you're doing. Let's talk about where you came from and where you're going. <laughs> and why right. you walked that Good? fast. You came out that door. Tell yeah. them who you are. Tell you who I am. Yes. Because, I mean, I'm most a young people... woman. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm just joking. Say, man. Um, most of you about to say, most people don't know, so let them know. Um, I'm a woman of many, many facets. A lot of people know me from being a host on MTV2 originally and also having a radio show on Sirius Satellite Radio. Right. Some people know me from replacing Natalie in Flowetry last summer. Wow. Yeah. Replacing. Yeah, so that was a wild time. And we went on a whole crazy tour at a house of blues all over the nation. It was just wild because a lot of people didn't know that she was replaced until they got to the show. So that was an interesting <laughs> wow. experience. Did they hate on you? <laughs> What? Crazy. I, yo, I'm not a fighter, but it was about to go down in a really? couple of locations. Wow. Yes. Wait, so what does that exactly mean? So you totally replaced her like you're part of Flowetry now? Or well, Flowetry just... is no longer anymore. Really? But, at the, but last summer, she bounced she from the group. She went out with Marsha. Yeah, wow. so I went out with Marsha, and we did a whole run. It was fun times. I mean, except for when people lost their minds. But by the end of every show, they would be like, yo, my bag. How was that nice, experience? You nice. And how was it when they called you, like, to be the replacement? Like, it was you not really I was right? just sitting there, and my homegirl, Angela Gee, I got to give her props. Shout that's my Angela. dog. She just sends me an email like, hey, do you want to replace Natalie and Floetry? I'm like, are you kidding? <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Yeah. So it was literally like that. And then I met their management. I met Marsha five days later. A week later, was we were Dr. in Philly. Was it Dr. Jason, the manager? Yeah, Jay Irvin. Jay, yeah. And then like two weeks later, we were in the studio, and then we were on the road. So was it going to be a fist fight with you and um the Flo G girl? No, yeah, the people Natalie? in the audience. Oh. No, 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 no. no, no, no. The people no, no, in the yeah. audience no, no, who that. realized that none she wasn't that. there anymore. Oh. <laughs> Yo, yeah, people in the audience didn't know that Natalie was replaced. And I mean, they were, can I curse on this? Yeah, go ahead. And they were literally like, who's this light-skinned, kicky head bitch? What the fuck? And I'm like, hey, yo, I'm just trying to sing my song. I'm I know. Trying sing sing like, trying to get a paycheck. I'm yeah, helping yeah. you guys out. It's there, <laughs> so, all right? But it was a great experience, and I think it helped to solidify for a lot of folks that I am a legitimate incredible artists a lot of people don't know that i started out on deaf poetry jam so they just were like oh when i decided to go completely to the music they were just like oh another vj trying to rap you know right. and sing and it's not true you know that's actually where i come from originally the vj thing and the radio thing just happened, happened from poetry yeah. Yeah. well you a woman of a lot of hats i see yeah what is the most lucrative hat you're wearing now Good um, question. Right? I would. That's a the Kangol question. hat. Like, yeah. <laughs> I would say the music is the music and television have always been my most lucrative because those have been the longest right. running. Like right now, I also I do visual art. I paint, and I never really pursued that. When you say paint, you mean Heather like Hunter throw the paint on your too. body, like with no. He wishes that. It oh, I'm body asking. Paint. No, like I paint on canvases. Oh, like, oh you are right though. Like body paint. Body paint. Yeah. That's right. yeah. <laughs> so he does that though. We're no, be because back. you can use me if you want to. Oh, wow. Yeah. He wants you to body paint. Light will be your canvas, but we're gonna be back with more Amanda Diva. She is in the building. She's officially here. Don't shrink yes. that mother effing screen. <laughs> we'll step on your neck and take your girl. 
What's up, y'all? It's Amanda Diva, the original Zufo. Chilling with Lenny S. Mida B. And Big Light right here on Rock Me TV. Don't drink that screen. 